so here is the other world that makes martial arts talent, Khabib Nurmagomedov, and there's so much made about his value as a corner man. Tonight, though, he is competing and has Bulas in his corner. Yeah, Coach Khabib is as undefeated as fighter Nurmagomedov compete again. This guy is the definition of pressure. He is trying to take you down, and he does not hide his intentions. He wants to get in your face, he wants to take you down, and he wants to drown you. This guy is a savage, he's a beast. Every word that describes that is Habib Nurmagomedov with a bull in his corner. Ready. Ready. Good. He is undefeated. He is one of the best pound for pound fighters in the world. And what a pain in the neck he is to fight. Habib Nurmagomedov figures to go to the takedowns early and often here tonight. But if he needs to strike, we have seen a constant evolution when it comes to his striking. This is one of the best fighters in any division. And Habib Nurmagomedov back at it tonight. Suck him out of the shoot here. Oh, that's big. Oh, Superman punch is good. Nurmago Medov gets plastered by that uppercut. And there he goes, lands another combination. His cardio is so good that, is, that it allows him to put forth this type of output. When his opponent is done at two, he is stringing. Nurmago Medov gets the double leg takedown. Nice job there, disguising his entry. Trying for a submission here. I think he's got it. It's deep. Oh, gives up on the submission now, so preferring to maybe get to a dominant position instead. Nurmago Medov gets caught by that straight punch. His defense has abandoned him tonight. That's a pretty good right hand there by your teammate, Khabib Nurmagomedov. You're so worried about the wrestling that when the hands come, you're not expecting it. And Habib lands early, and he lands often. Oh, big elbow. Nice jab by him there, and I guess on the other side, hard to get your offense going when your head keeps getting snapped back like a Pez dispenser. Every time he tries to go forward and use his own offense, the jab is stopping him in his tracks. He's doing a great job of fighting behind him. Back and forth we go. Nermanko Medov gets the double leg takedown. How good was that? Under three minutes now to go in the round. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. Now goes to the uppercut. He's got great kicks also. He needs to be throwing more kicks in this fight. He hasn't thrown uh, many at all. All right, half guard for him here, and a lot of offensive options, I would think, at his disposal. Oh, he's got it. Come on, come on now. Oh, he's got the Kimura position locked in now. You gotta be kidding me. How did he get out? He just stayed calm. He's able to withstand the fire, and now he finds himself out and safe. Lands the ground and pound strike here. Another ground and pound strike gets home. All right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. All right, late round action here on Khabib Nurmagomedov, as usual, having his way with another opponent. Just such a nuanced game on the ground. I mean, this dude is so good at using his wrestling and grappling skills to control his opponents. He is a bear on top, and I'm saying that literally. And tonight, he is showing that his strength is on another level. His opponent looks like Big double leg, level change. Yep, and he's got him secured in the half guard now. Look to the head there by Nermago Meta. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Always be closing. Busy in the clinch here, the punch is good. Well, you gotta think frustration is starting to set in on the other side as he lands another takedown, and he knew he was gonna get a lot of this. He's gonna start trying to move to a submission here. It looks like he's trying to attack with an arm triangle. 
Oh, he's got it locked in tight now. Oh, he got out. How good is that? This guy is so aware. He never leaves anything long to allow for himself to get subbed. Just out of range with that left hook. Nice crack there. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Now they separate. Back to the jab now. 20 seconds to go in round one. Nice punch to the head. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Awesome level change. Great timing. Mago Medov's in half guard now. Close guard. Second round, straight ahead. All right, so that's the end of the round. A lot of highlights from which to choose, but his success in that round certainly rooted in his offensive takedown game. And that's what he does, right? He's a grinder. He's the type of guy that wants to get a hold of you, drag you to the floor. It doesn't bother him that much if you get back to your feet. He just wants to continue to make you work the entire time because he understands this type of grind most guys can't keep up with. You ready to fight? Ready. Four. Second round on the way. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this round. He had a big effort there in round one. Really had the wrestling on full display. John, if he was looking to come out here, secure takedown, to feel good about the way things are going, he gets an A on his report card. Because takedown after takedown was secured, top position was secured, and as you watch that clock, that blow up the top control, him and his team are ecstatic. Because yeah. they know when they're on top, when they're secured takedowns, they're winning. Well, any time you are in a ground-fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fun. As he gets close and he's out of the kicking range, he'll, suddenly, he'll change his stance. Oh, nice. Well, new round, same narrative. He continues to punish the body yet again, just as he did in the previous frame. Oh, nice double leg, yes. Fighter better move. Yeah, he's got to move, John. He's got to shrimp and try to either get up or pull his opponent back into him so he doesn't have the posture to land that big damage. Well, not good body language from his opponent here, DC. He's curled up. No, he's exhausted. He's been beaten. Really doing a nice job getting these shots home on the ground. Looks like a potential submission attempt here. Ooh, that Camaro looks tight. Somehow, some way, he gets the arm out. It looked like he was done, John, but he was able to stay comfortable, stay patient, and now he finds himself safe. Try to establish that jab. All right, so the hands are crispy tonight. Not exactly what we thought we would see out of this wrestler, but as a former two-time U.S. Olympian yourself with some hands, <laughs> you can fall in love with this. You can fall in love with the striking, but he is showing tonight that everything starts with his wrestling. It gives it a level change, which then in turn helps him land in the striking. He looks fantastic. I did not expect him to look this good in the boxing tonight. Marmanko Manoff's going for a choke. Oh, he might be in trouble here. He got out again. Wow, that is fantastic submission defense. Big ground and pound. All right, the referee not seeing enough action there. We go back to the center of the octagon now. Well, he misses with the left punch there. All right, what do you think? Another takedown attempt here. It seems like every time he's gone to the well, it's been there tonight. When you're that successful with any one thing, why would you change it? He's gonna shoot for another takedown, and I would almost be willing to bet he's gonna secure. I'll take your action. Okay. Just over two minutes to go. Take it for a ride. Nice double leg, nice finish. Oh, nice job working hard, posting, and getting back up. Uppercut lands. He's throwing these punches in combination, really dictating the base to his opponent. What a punch.
punch got blocked there. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Fighter lands a nasty kick. Nurmagomedov gets another takedown here. Good sign for him here. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. Now he's got good body position, yup. All right, right into side control here, DC. Biggest difference between half guard and side control. Well, side control to me feels like a little bit less control because now my legs aren't really doing anything anymore. Now I'm controlling. Oh, Kimura attack. Yep. Oh, that Kimura looks tight. Oh, the submission defense holds up and gets out. He said that he was ready for everything that would be thrown at him. In that position, he showed that and proved it. to establish the jab here. Nicely done by Nermagomedov. Oh, he's got hand skills for days. Beautiful combination of punches to the head. Oh, he gets the takedown late in the round here. That's a way to leave an impression on the judges. And big picture, I think, could set him up for future success in the next round. So there's the end of the round, the storyline over those previous five minutes. Volume takedowns, offensive wrestling. Yeah, this is an exhausting type of fight. Not only for the offensive fighter, but also for the opponent. Always being under attack, always being defensive, always reacting starts to really wear at your gas tank. It's interesting to see who is more fresh going into the next round. You ready to fight? Ready. Yeah. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. All right, next round is underway. You know these are two of the more conditioned fighters on the roster, so cardio is not going to be an issue here. And for some fighters, you know, you can have one of those adrenaline dumps or the cardio abandons you on fight night. Not the case for these two guys. Both look very fresh as we start this next round. Just missed with that right hand. He lands another strike to the body here, really starting to connect on a lot of strikes to the midsection here in the latter stages of this fight. Nice jab there. On the shot, there you go, single leg. Good job being a threat off your back and not allowing your opponent to get comfortable. Your Mago Medoffs in half guard. A lot of top pressure being applied here as he works out of side control. Ooh, it's tight. Still trying to get the submission here. It's over. He's work. He's work. Oh, he got out. He got out. He defended. John, I thought it was over. I thought it was done. It was so tight. It was deep. They were hip to hip. I thought the fight was done. Great job and awareness by this young man to defend that dark show. Well, now you see some visible damage on the side underneath the elbow. He told us he was going to invest in the body. He hasn't missed a whole lot tonight. You didn't expect him to do it this effectively. He's done a fantastic job of following the game. Oh, he's in a lot of trouble. Both guys appeared to land there. So again, he shoots for a takedown. He has certainly tried to wrestle offensively tonight, but that attempt did not work. We only see a commitment to trying to secure those takedowns. We did not anticipate him having to take this many attempts. How long until he gets stirred? Another big takedown. Oh, and he is 
escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Well, the body work's starting to take its toll. Look at the redness starting to appear on his left side. Straight punch is true. Beautiful kick to the body. Oh, is he putting it all together tonight? Another huge kick by Shooter throw. Let's see if he can capitalize and lock up the sub. You gotta try to find whether or not you're gonna land. Ground and pound here or if you're gonna go to submission. Oh, submission defense on full display there. He said that he was very aware of what this guy brought to the octagon and the show in that defense. Good stick. Man, it's almost like he's got a range finder out there. Just too easy as he connects with another good series of punches. If you're boxing this guy and only boxing him, you will be in trouble. Oh, nice knee. Oh, and the Superman punch is good. He gets to his spot, the tie clinch. Then he starts to let the knees fly. And he gets it. Another submission attempt here, and this is a good one. Oh, that looks tight to me. It looks like it might be locked in. Yeah, it looks like it's done. It looks like it's done. Oh. Coming up huge tonight. Oh, my goodness. So what a win for him here tonight. He gets it done and gets it done by way of submission. He told us this week, I got to keep these judges out of it. Mission accomplished. Absolutely. He is a phenomenal grappler. He said that he held the advantage there, and that would show itself in the fight. He proved that, and he gets a submission victory. Amazing. All right, let's take a look back at the replay as he gets it done by submission tonight, champ. Just watch how slowly he approaches the submission, though. He never rushes. He takes his time, but it's his trickiness. It's his ability to trick people into going to the floor with him that puts them in danger and finishing fights. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at four minutes, four seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by chop out due to a Kimura. And still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Habib the Ebola Hermano Meta. All right, you heard it there from Bruce Buffer, Khabib Nurmagomedov, the winner by submission here.